today today uh, we will be having our second lecture and it's the, in this uh, second lecture we will be having our topic regarding the international standards so in this topic you will be able to to understand why safety is very important to the site or to the area where activities are uh, ongoing so in this presentation I would like to uh, credit this uh, presentations to ILO or the International Labor Organization ILO by the way class is an organization in international that addresses the the concerns the safety and the rights of the labors so labors meaning uh, it it is a it is a group of people or people or a certain individual who works in a company or in a certain a company that uh, has or there where there are lots of people who are working also so labor it's 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 a wide definition of labor meaning uh, uh, it is not about labor meaning uh, uh, this uh, they call that cunning uh, 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 ato ang pagsabot sa Bisaya nga labor meaning uh, workers nga uh, they're working the, uh, the the work nga medyo pababa sa kuan sa sa sa, uh, sa ranking no so dili na siya sa labor ang spelling nga labor nato dili by the way l l a b o u r so meaning work people working people okay so to begin with Let's have our first slide. So, this is a global database of safety and health. This is the So, you will be able to know the, the, the status of our occupational safety and health globally. So, through ILO. So, Money Atong Governing Body International. So, don't forget to have this uh, ILO. It is database compiles the wealth of legislation in occupational safety health. And it serves as a snapshot of the current major national legislative requirements around the globe. So, in this particular organization, the, the countries, or for example, the Philippines, is required to... To conduct or to practice occupational safety and health. Now, the meaning of ILO is International Labor Council. Uh, ILO is International Labor Organization. Okay, so here ILO Constitution defines the workers. No. The workers that is being protected by the law. Okay. So in this slide also class, there is a tool that is what we call Legos. It is an uh, an OSH or a tool that is used to collect data internationally. So from the Philippines, from Middle East, from Europe, from America. They all gather the data. No, uh, the people, uh, the organization, is trying to to analyze, to interpret the data that is being collected from the different areas, different countries, different locations, different language, different behaviors, and different culture. Okay, so that is that is what we call uh, an international standards.
so here uh, in this next slide uh, we try to use the international labor standards as the benchmark when you talk about benchmark classes uh, it is a it is a certain agency a standard ruling as a, a an organization uh, which uh, which use the uh, or which practice the best uh, the best practices no good practices instead uh, implementing the correct procedures in handling safety so in this international labor standards different countries from different countries to different locations they are all setting the standards through ILO so without ILO so medyo uh, tagilid tagamay no uh, na asay basis of having this regulation okay next So in this slide also class, uh, in the next slide, uh, main class classification structure, it is uh, the, the rule or how ILO being structured. No? So, giunsa siya or unsa na as ILO. Okay? So here, ato ni hinayinay basa. First is we have the description of the national OSH regulatory framework. So it pang define na to sa to mga regulation framework nga nakaset sa ILO. Second, ang scope, coverage and exclusions. Ko so mura siya og kanang uh, what are the limitations? Ka scope no coverage meaning up to what limit no ang range sa iya ang mandate ang man aya ang pag mandate sa law or pag regulate sa law. Ang disclosures, so sometimes ang mga tayo mga exemptions of the rule or sometimes na yung mga uh, you have to try understand the things that are uh, kanabitang need to consider na na silang mga uh, na sila yung mga exemptions so, that's what uh, exclusions third one is institutions programs relating to OSH administration and or enforcement of OSH legislation so, uh, nata kita wag na people who are uh, behind sa tuang or sa ILO organization. Employers also duties responsible to protect the safety and health of workers. Okay, so the the employers. So for example, I am working sa Saudi Arabia. No, that always I always I am always giving an example through my experience. Okay. If I don't have experience, I will be able to share also to you. No? In my six years in Saudi Arabia, what I have experienced there in class is that the company uh, where uh, the company that uh, who hires you, or who hires you, no? sa, so, sa imo ang, uh, who hires you here in the Philippines and <clears throat> bring you there. And then they all protect you. They will be the one uh, in charge and uh, responsible for the the safety, no? The safety of the worker. So we need to say, if I'm going to Saudi Arabia, the company itself should protect me in all aspects, as long as it is related to work. Okay. Sometimes, naman tayo kitawag na naman po nila sila ang kanilang employers mga dati nila na sila kita mga exclusions so dako po nila definitions we cannot we cannot define directly that employers all or all of the time no the employers is responsible no as long as it is not related as as long as it is related to work then it's no problem but if it is not related to work that is what we call exclusions so meaning it's a private or it's a private thing it's a personal thing it's your decisions and you are uh, try uh, you are uh, you are deciding something that causes uh, trouble that causes chaos or anything that uh, which affects the the company the the community itself or 
anybody from your area. So that is what they call explosions. Also, employers duty to organize prevention formally along generally accepted research management principles and practices. So by the way class, in my experience also class, the employers also have these different units. So the own uh, uh, giving uh, uh, extra kanang extra uh, uh, extra uh, units no, not, not, not extra but uh, something like specialized units that uh, that seeking for the protection of each workers especially when you are working sa job site no sa sa area sa sa to us construction is the common siya field so they will protect the employers will provide a definite safety plan for everybody okay next slide employers also duty, uh, employers duty also is to ensure availability of expertise and competence health and safety so they don't like to uh, they don't uh, give you uh, safety precautions or safety uh, measurements uh, or measures uh, that is not uh, sure of of the thing that he is doing no? and sometimes uh, especially in the kingdom yeah, sometimes no uh, if you are trying to complain sir I have a, a headache I, I don't know what to do I need to rest so directly other people or other safety officer I, I, it's just yeah, just uh, a witness example I don't like to 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 give names no Okay, uh, it's a confidential thing. But sometimes when I na nga, uh, nga practice nga, okay, I just drink, just take this medicine, and uh, it will be okay later on. So just relax. So sometimes it is okay, but if it is not expert and what he is practicing for the long time, and did he don't know that maybe it's it. Uh, it complicates the thing that you are taking no? the medicine that is not good maybe if you are having an allergy if you're having an allergy and you're taking the medicine so what will be the effect no it will complicate things so sometimes you have to you no know, sometimes the art you know not sometimes but it should be the law uh, the employees responsibility or duties to provide the uh, provides uh, expertise na or expertise or train people you know, to ensure the, the 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 protocol or the practice is being being implemented correctly you know? okay next is uh, workers rights and duties also uh, Filipinos have many rights and <laughs> rights though I'm always a Filipino so well anyway only one good uh, we are human being and we are protected by the law. So no one, other people should not be harmed. Mugine, muna sa duty sa so sa kabalaot. No, ang people, ang government should protect the people. Ina na yun siya. Dilipid nga dilipotektahan niya ang people. Okay, but if you are talking about workers, no, muna nga ang workers na sila rights. No, how about if for example, we're working sa Manila Bay. So, we'll give an example about Manila Bay. Nahulog or na, na, na kuan baka itong bako nga nagkuan na ito. Na, natumba ang bako niya na i-accidente. Niya, katoday nga, katoday yung kuan kay, katoday yung nagtrabaho rin ito kay prior to that is na na siya hibate. Baka na COVID. Example lang ha. Sa po lang niya, na COVID day siya. Niya, sakit yung ulo niya, ipapugos siya sa trabaho. No, wala sa niya hapon is tila sa siya magsaba aw parang uh, dilip yung sa magsaba dapat siya kay kuan yan dilip yung mga gipilit siya ba uh, in for, uh, forcing him to do things nga that is against to his to, uh, to his will no? uh, not good na siya rights and of course duties kanin duties mo is a wide range duties is all about the responsibilities and 
uh, obey obeying the 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 plan or the safety plan or the procedures safety procedures that has been implemented no? so working site consultation collaboration cooperation with workers and their representatives specific hazards or risk okay na ana siya different hazards so, anyway later on sa to ang discussion for so, us this we go along sa tong discussion is na yung mga risk ana recording notification investigation of work related accidents so we have to record notify investigate dayon OSH is inspection and enforcement of OSH legislation so every time nagina siya gitaw nga uh, ang sa ano ba na mostly ang gitaw na ana is the, there's a run through there is specific uh, inspection or an annual quarterly semi annually ngana or monthly nga inspection in order nga masunod ba or has been implemented correctly okay, sometimes man good nga kaila ra ang labor and safety officer ay kira ni ay ko ni ko re bala sa mga so that's the tip na dapat gap when it comes to work then it's work it's all about work when it comes to friendship or friends forever then you will be friends na you are like we always finish it's a friends if you're friends then you have to obey or have to respect what i am working no really putting uh, you you pero ang pilipino magot kay nagnana nga te oh, sige lang next time lang nana okay let's go to the next slide it's all about the international labor standards and social safety and health it's all about ILO So here in this slide, I will not read ha, kay taas kay ni siya. Uh, ILO is defined about the workers protection. So you protect the ILO constitution ang workers. And also here na asay data we provide no. There is about 2.78 million work related deaths sa data niha katong akong ipon na global situations or trends. Dapat ta gitawa ka 2.4 million related occupational diseases so, mga sakit sakit dayon it, resu it resulted to a 3.94 percent nga loss sa gdp or kanabitang gross na to nga nga kuan sa atong economy so therefore nai 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 effect uh, big effect sa to ang globe uh, sa tong economy ang ang losses o ang mga accidents na pwede mo as long as it is work related so nga adya ang ILO okay next um, next is next one uh Employers face quarterly retirements. No? ILO also, standards of safety and health provide essential tools for governments, employers work in establish such as practice provide maximum safety and work. So, natin kita wag rin nga uh, high insurance premiums. Ang term mo ha premiums. Federal health. No? My God, no comment. Magkalik yung walito ko oral. Pwede uh ah, sige, I will relate this one to fellow health, but I am not talking about the the thing under investigation. I'm just talking about how workers should be protected in terms of their insurance and premiums. No? Uh for example, uh uh, uh the people who are working, it should be nga na sila yung mga uh protection nga yeah, later on maka tabang sila ha it, sa mga butang-butang example ka ng accident sila or incident pag wala naman wala po kay mura siya og ins ang insurance mo guys i don't know if uh, i think some of you are familiar with the insurance now philip philip Phil is also an insurance it is some way or somehow a protection for you in an annual basis 
So, continue ang ito ang payment. Ani. So, every month, so, for example, ako, uh, ako example ang sa, sa gawas kay Aram, sa kanahan mo, kay ang sa Philippines common man. Sa gawas class, ay, although sa gawas, we are protected already. Na, nami mga premium to ito, but insurance, nagya po, nami, nami cards, nami tagaan mi cards, ano nga, up to that limit lang. So, may 50,000, 30,000, 70,000, ano, depende sa contribution. So, for example, ako kay katong uh, kay mandated mangod katong nai nai controversial about sa field about OFW nga mandated ang OFW to pay something or akong yearly ganito class is 2400 so nalanggi times nga uh, na ako ay na feel I, I have uh, kanang kanang I was diagnosed nga na ako ay cyst sa ko ang tuhod. So, uh, what I did is I have to stop working abroad and I have to uh, check if it is uh, good nga dili siya i-operahan uh, or good siya nga dapat operahan. So, what I did is uh, I, let, I, let, I let the doctors Uh, the doctor discover or diagnose my my cyst no so dito naoperahan ko so in result of that so after six years no after six years of working abroad so what i have only is the 2400 na katong wala pa na expire na kung afield health nga tong ongoing na kung afield health nga e katong mga previous na kung afield health sa afield health hindi naman ito mo bound kay ano yung mga Every year protected ta, every year protected ta, every year protected ta. So dito rin siya mo range, dito siya mo, mo range sa pila ka katuwig nagbahayad sa PhilHealth. Nana. Nana siya kakuan. Oh, sa akong pagsabot lang niya, sa akong ngon nga pagsabot kay, although natagaan ko ito, ay, oh, I don't know kung ma-happy ko pero na-happy yung pugko kayo. Pag abot na ko sa, kaya na-confine man ko for 5 days after operation, stay ko for Uh, three four uh, three days uh, three days more para sa ko ang ko ano uh, pag pag uh, at least ma arang arang ako ang lawas no, to recover para sa next item to work na no, before I'm going uh, before I am applying for a job there is a USTP so I was being operated operated oh, was uh, hmm? there is an operation nga na itabo sa ko ang tiil So, muna nga, in relation to that, how about if you don't have money, then so happy nga, ikaw ah, nagsakit. Kaya dabi ko, kung daghan ka ayaw nagsakit nga, wala mga, wala wala payment or wala contribution. So, the government will shoulder everything there. So, I I don't think so, no? Uh, listen siya, because, uh, Atong culture mo is not that kind of rich. I mean, I ako sa so understanding sa country when I work uh, sa other countries is poor gid atong country. Never could you think na dato atong country. Munang gaw, munang gaw, kaya ako muna nang before is because I am working. Is the meaning of this is the country is so uh, is poor and you no, know, I am working abroad na. It's so, meaning to say, my country is poor. Ano, ano akong tingin? Sa una rin. Karon, when I work here, sa school, um, poor, <laughs> poor kaya yeah, po. Poor pipes, poor pipe na lang. <laughs> joke lang. Poor pipe na lang a month. <laughs> Tungod sa utang. <laughs> Ay, sorry, joke lang. Uh, and that uh, Sige, next to next. Okay. Mm. Here, uh, may kitawag na ito, key instruments on occupational safety and health. So, na yung mga conventions that are being established and ang kanang itong declared no, para to to have uh, uh, to, to gather data the same time and to update the the records 
with regards to the uh, accidents or the the come on, the trend of safety in each country okay ang convention sa mga kay mahita wa siya yearly no sa sa sa, sa si yearly mato conventions meaning on say bag on say new sa to ang sa to ang profession when it comes to structural when it comes to materials when it comes to designs when it comes to sa uh, equipment when it comes to practice kay ang ang conventions class are not only about uh, uh, making friends uh, or kanang bitong kanang tutuno some of those engineers or some professionals niya nga wala ni mo na ilhan dili wala ang, ang conventions mo are decide to to learn something from it so for example kani uh, 1981 number 55 so kani mo gud sa convention 1981 na pare na ba si 2006 ah nara pare 2006 class kaning 2006 eh, or number one eight seven one eight seven siya pero I don't know ano ano ni so we have to read okay mamon ko an example naman po ni siya nga conventions so according to these conventions and the government uh, provide uh, the the institution provide coherent and systematic treatment uh, it is a way of uh, uh, of sharing information, knowledge, and to uh, to have a dialogue between government workers, employees, and uh, some of the safety culture na gina practice. So, na have you remembered about the the to prom uh, a national preventive safety health uh, safety and health culture? Katong studies sa uh, yung taga Colombia nga they are having uh, they found out that practicing safety culture makes the company uh, good or kanang dilita malos di ba? according sa itong na kung discuss earlier nga kung ang company day kung practice of uh, proper safety dili day, dili day siya ma malos sa itong GDP no? gross man, gross domestic kwan gross domestic so, I study kusura sa P, but uh, let's try. Ato lang nang i-define later. Okay. Uh, next is katong ganina kung hindi ko ano. Okay. Uh, 981185. So, 981185. It is about the... Okay. One type uh, adaptation of an actions taken to uh, for improvements. So, kani siya nga uh, convention class na asay ka ng how government or how other countries should take actions to the the, the present situations and improve their practices into the best nga nga way of solving that issues or concerns so it needs to preview the if uh the the today's service uh requirements meaning uh we will look up to kanang kanang the 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 common procedures now, why is it that it's always happening? No, for example, na na accident is it? Sa excavation. Ano mo siya mga accident sa excavation? Yung tukoy ramo nga practice. So what else do we need to to do or to improve in order nga maintain na to ang or ma improve na to ang ang progress or ma ano na progress at to ang implementation sa ako. Okay, next is sa one six one nineteen eighty five. In this ah. Uh, particular convention it's also a funny, uh, convention the interfra inter enterprise enterprise is defined as interested maintain the safety environment so uh, it is the the employer's duty to maintain the uh, safety precautions in workplace okay we have to go next 
So here, dagan mana? Dagan kau mahu practices yang na available sa ILO, but what I did only is to focus only to the safety and health in construction convention. This under number one six seven from nineteen eighty eight. So that is according to ILO also. Okay, next slides, slide rather. So by the way, class, uh, here, kaning kaning mga mga conventions class or mga kanang practices, nani sila kanang katawag ng ato mga implementing rules, no? How you are going to to consider or how you are going to abide the rules? So nani sila mga policy yah, regulations niya ato niya nang sa. So nasa ni preamble, na preamble. So ang preamble is a convention from different locations and organizations so kinangalan di ay nga kung unsa tong kung unsa tong na practice or unsa tong gi provide sa organization it should be followed dili pwede nga gi gi appeal sa mura sa og ato ang panata mura sa na unsa ba sa panata anang mura sa ato ang duty nga nga to follow or to obey no? obey the the conventions nga nga gi provide sa to sa international standards so mo niya preamble so ikon ni siya sa Geneva Geneva course ah uh, okay. sa Geneva sa America America mo siguro oh, lagi America so kani So, mani mga names sa constitution so nag nag focus lang ko karon sa kwa sa sa construction in 1988 kani Okay let's go to the article 1 So in article 1 we have to define the convention so the conventions meaning katong kung yung earlier na uh, it is the the word conventions meaning there is a new trend Find the solution, uh, suggest the solutions, adapt the solutions, and practice the solutions. Huh? Or practice the solutions. Okay? So, muna article 1. Ang article 2, nasi koan, uh, it's all about definition. So, you have to study here, class. No? The common definitions, for example, construction. What are, what is what the term construction? Covers what? So, Malaysia building. Uh, next is. Uh, so, dagana siya ha, sa sa word niya construction. Dili lang na uh, building. Tanan nga activities. Malaysia construction. Nasa second din nga definition. Uh, sa civil engineering. Nasa including nga excavation. Construction structural alteration. So, tanang construction nga feel ah nga na ay involvement mo na siya construction okay ah construction site also here so ah it's about the operations no operations sa site so unsa 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 ilang gibuhat sa site area other one is workplace so it's a places of work you believe I'm a cat. Workplace meaning where you are assigned to. So, kana assigned sa office, the fields, sa bus, driver, na. Then workers. Then here, worker. Of course, it's a person, no? Who are working. Employer katong company. Next is competent person. Kaniya definition. Kinalan niya ako. Training, sufficient knowledge, and qualifications. Scaffold. Scaffolds are temporary, so you have to understand this one. Temporary. Meaning, sa temporary, will last forever. Ah, temporary is. It will be placed. It will be positioned. It will be used in a short period of time. So. Although it is fixed, no? Okay, of course we have to support the people. Uh, 
who are using the scaffolds no kay scaffolds are used to 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 support workers in doing their job especially at heights no here we have also here the lifting paano lifting appliance so pwede ni siya katong uh, katong mga cranes uh, katong mga trucks nga kuan na na adat to na da kan sa site lifting gear so gear nga word nga gear so kaning mga uh, you uh, kaning gamiton nga nga material para gamit uh, gamiton nga material para i lift ang usa ka material for example uh, mostly kay akong experience nga mostly ang gina lift kay kana mga mga frames sa kuan kanang steel frames nga from one kanang kanang from members sa uh, structure ba or members sa uh, usa ka building for example beams so yung frame ana is steel man or some i beam uh, so yun lang na i discuss ako an sa yung steel design o i think sa RC na siya uh, RC concrete din dili dai steel design like uh, when i'm talking about the uh, I-beam man. I normally say, I would get discussed when you're putting it on the side. Although, strength of materials, theory of structures, I think you are aware of, uh, I don't know if you can say it in a theory, karun, but uh, I'm sure you can say it in theory. Okay, next is, what's up, I would have to discuss. So, Article 3 na ta, on general provisions. So, sa Article 3 class, uh, ang yan lang kung ano is assign a person in charge on the safety measures. So, uh, certain company, mag-assign siya og units para mo in charge siya uh, safety. Then, ang Article 4, adopt and maintain the laws or regulations. Meaning to say, after assigning a certain person, so, sa to pong katong person po, the people or the workers should follow and respect or obey the, the rules set by the that person. Nga ang katong sa Article 4 nga it should be adapt, nga maintain ang pag-work sa safety. So, Article 5 class. So, na yung mga standards nga dapat na to i-practice or i-follow atong mga codes nagi koan sa Article 4 kay ang Article 4 class kay regulations so mag-set sa mga standards policies so of course kanin Article 5 so mura yung mga provisions nga naa naa dad to ng mga codes then ang Article 6 is about ensuring no workers ensuring the the relationship between workers and employers no Kumbaga, ano yun yun? It's a give and take. Hindi pwede nga ang employer na po. Na wala po yung, wala po yung bugas. Kinala nyo sa employer, yun yung sala, yun yung employer. Ah, binako. Wala po yung palit sa kuan. Kanang make-up. Sala na yun yun sa kuan. Goberno. So, dili na na. Okay? So, it's a give and take. Meaning, uh, for example, so we're, if we are talking about construction or safety, so he ensures the employer, he ensures the employer that his ang worker is safe. And vice versa, kani pung si ang worker, he ensure po niya or his duty is, kung ako define sa workers nga, mo engage sa safety measures nga gi aside sa ilaha sa so, employer. So kung maga Muna na may mga standards diha, na may mga sets, na may mga, yung, mga expert diha na diha. Now, we have to follow our duties to follow. Hindi kayo mag-inahit po tag-ulo. Eh, sometimes, raba na, sarili, no, sa gawas, kay ah, mas gahi, kay yung kaubanan rin ang Pilipino. May paning na ibang lahi, kay yung follow pa. I'm sure lang. <laughs> Article 7, uh, it's all about the national laws. So, workers and employers' duties. So, na yung mga duty, ana sa mga employers' duty. So, 
Kumbaga, diba, sa Article 6, kay naayin siya ito nga agreement between workers and workers. So, pag Article 7 din, class, diri, diri, naa, diri, gi, 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 latag, graphic of the site, or gi, 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 discuss ang, ang, gi, discuss niya ang, so, naa, diri, gi, discuss class ang, what can uh, national law no muna ang law nga dapat i follow okay, so next ata article 8 so more than one employee the employer and worker are responsible so of course dili pwede nga uh, kung halimbawa no kanang a certain company or society no dili uh, pwede isara in worker the kan mo good na so, kung dagani mo worker, iba kung company ta, construction, contractor na lang, for example, contractor A, no? Kalib, uh, kalibara na lang, ano or ang engineering uh, engineering firm ni Don, no? engineering firm, uh, engineering firm, or Don's engineering services, ba? So, ang button is, Ani, uh, nai simultaneous activities that are being implemented sa site. Example, so, kung dagan ang buildings, dili mo na pwede ng uniform sila o activities. Ang ano, kung uniform sila sa activity, meaning yung active, uniform activities, meaning nabuhos sila dili, buhos, buhos, buhos. So, magbuhos tanan, so, dagan kita o, or dili kayo makuha ang tao, dili sa babahin. So, meaning, may group rin pa rin buwan. So, naigroup sa civil, naigroup sa electrical, na pwede group sa mechanical. So, kanang tulo, na pwede electronics at pilang. Uh, ang architect, na agap po. Sige. So, five. No? Seiya? Ito. College. Seiya? College of Engineering Architecture. Sige. So, nani siya. Simultaneous ang job. So, sa civil, so, ang ang architect, so, na sila sa office, implementing sa designs, na, Ang kaling civil, implement siya sa umbaw na concrete. So, dito sila sa concrete thing. Na po yung electrical nga, na ongoing nila ang paglantaw sa mga wiring, sa sa ibutang, o sa yanay na humanay ang construction. Na po yung mechanical. So, ang mechanical mag-input or mag- kanang mag-plaster sa construct sa civil kung asa dapat i-mount or i-fix ang equipment nga dili siya mahulog or meaning to say stable siya dito nga area so for example higher heights or uh, higher kanang location so kinahalan siya og high kinahalan siya og mga lifting kuan aparatos so dito na po ito sa sa electronics uh, so electronics it's about kuan kanang uh, communications lines so check na to dito kung kung ang lines ba sa electrical wiring so, so ang lines ba sa communication is na arrange ba together with electrical so yun na simultaneous ang job sa article 8 so sa una lang no you have to quote kid muna nga uh, muna nga na ang responsibility ang workers o ang employers hindi pwede ang employers ba article 9 is all about the design and timing uh, inclusion of safety so uh, masiguro ko sa kuha niya siya, management niya. So, kinalan, mag-provide uh, mag ang management team sa ilang safety ordinance or safety measures. And Article 10, workers are workers' right and duty to participate or also uh, express their views. So, so, so muto akong ngayon ganina katong if you are not feeling well and the employer is forcing you to do work, then that's not good. No, as per ILO, you have the rights to to express your voice as long as it is valid and uh, na siya, na siya confirmation. So, for example, sick ka. So, kinang ka to sa doctor nga, to, to, or medical team nga, or sa safety. Nga, nga, uh, uh, sir, I'm charged. So, lain akong gibati kan kan can I have my check up before I will be going to have my work? So, of course, the safety, that is his job to ensure you that you are safe. 
right so you have to voice out or express the things that you are going to express okay now we even good okay sometimes tungod po lagi kay natay rights okay lentan ko uma ako yung mag-declare delete pwede yan okay para sa mag-quiz ba kaya na mag-quiz ta ha na dapat tinantan si kuma kaya na maka-excuse ko din take lang din ko sa insaktong oras kaya na oras kaya na bagit ko katoon na kuma bilihin na na ang mindset should be honest nga reason okay article 11 tas tas pa rin 11 is workers protocol and duties comply the guidelines so say mo naman eh atong mga duty sa sa so you have to read and understand so article 11 is all about how workers should understand and obey the set or safety plan measures article 12 worker to remove himself from the interest so same lagi ako ni atong uh, excuse me article 10 pura <laughs> sa Workers, uh, na siya right ba? So, inform, basta as long as they have to inform the supervisor. Okay, kung dilipod, 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 pwede nga. Wala lang kabalo ang supervisor. You have to text, you have to to find. Okay, sa ating immediate supervisor, if what kind number, ask, ito kasi mo ang kauban. Yan yeah, yung kauban mo yung inform. Okay, at least, kabali mo supervisor. Okay, let's go to our third question. Preventive measures. Okay, so it's all about how we are being uh, protected and it should be preventive, no? Article 13, so we have the safety uh, for places. So example, work as an office. So, it's an office lang na plus, dagan kayo safety precautions diha. For example, uh, I'm going pictures there, eh? Kanin ay nasa'y ka ng process of practice determination of overall task. So, pag-determine mo, halimbawa, uh, sa entire day, kinalan ni ko magpapirma sa mga documents. Ikan din sa mga office. Padulong sa lain office. Ngayon mo agay pa ko. O, tulog ka hagdan. O, duwa ka dalan. <laughs> Kadawa, breaking the down the task in its basic steps. So, for example, oh, kanang, so kanyang, ah, uh, magbaklay man ko ani. So, unsa kong buhaton, hinay na kong saka. Okay. Next, identification of hazards uh, associated with each step. Uh, so, kung, halimbawa, yung dalan, na may doon ka dalan, yung syempre, prone siya sa kuan, kina may mong dagat. Pili ka mga aksidente na ito. So, yun siyang inkon. Lalo sa kaya hazard ano yun. Kasi maligsan niya. Kung dire mo dagbakle baklay lang ko. So, kinangan ka. Aware sa potential hazard. Ah, dili kong maagi dire kay Corbada. Dito kong maagi sa layo pa makita na ka. So, number four is determination of preventive measures for minimizing the risk. So, for example, although risk is there, always may ng risk, but it should be minimized. Okay. La, at least dili ka nga ma-expose yun la unsa kay preventive measures mo at class it's, it's all about uh, the the procedures nga or the assumptions of a certain risk uh, that might occur in a short period of time so meaning la pwede ko mabanggaan diri or pwede ko maligsan diri, or pwede ko mahulog diri sa internet. Huwag siya kong buhaton para mabuhat na akong uh, safety ko. Or diri sa office, uh, kinahulan, kanyang mga wires, tatungo na ako ni Kandik, kung kung siya kong buhaton, magtanaw ba kung magtuplok kaysa yung um, uban. Sanasa na katanaw, nagtuplok sa wire, yung kato sa outlet, na korente, yung pass. Okay, so we have to do preventive measures. And five, then that is Writing of safe working procedure or safe work practice. So, in short, then how do you know what you can provide? What can you provide to the safety department? You know, 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 
Okay, next. Okay, so this is an example. I didn't know. Example. Okay. Next is uh, scaffolds. Article for the scaffolds and ladders. So no. scaffolds. I think I have discussed this one. No. It's a young year. So no, young example here. Ni mga scaffoldings. No. It is uh, made of steel. So na dito sa na ting na matut sa Facebook na made of bamboo. They are using bamboo instead of steel. Pero you know, as uh, para sa kwa, although it's possible, it's always possible kasi sa unang panalo may steel kahoy raman ta. So possible yun. Especially bamboo. Bamboo are, are grass nga or a certain type of koan nga nang ginagamit siya tungkol siya ang elasticity and tensile strength. So, okay lang. <coughs> Pero a structure like this needs ka ng stable. Okay. Wala, dili kayo mo stable siya. Mahugno yun na ang kalikutan or mahugno yung kaugma ang kalay na stable. Mahulog ka! So, kinanang mo mapractice ka safety or kinanang ka mag-check si Mohan. Dili up to you. So, kanay mga ladder. Na may mga ladder dito yun. Kana, kung saan paggamit sa ladder, magsikit mo na kayo. Sara ba ng dalan? So, kanay okay raman yun dito. Kanay dito yun. For example, kung saan mo gunika dalan na alam mo Ginagdana mo dia, dagan-dagan. Isa, one at a time, na o dagan. So, yun na na ang ladder. Next, we have Article 15, Lifting Appliances and Interiors. So, muna yung ganyan natong gidefine. Ha, muna nyo siya yung discussion. So, dyan itong Lifting Appliances, katong beliefs at tayo. So, yung gear, siya. Example yun. Ito yung example. Hmm. No, ito yung example. Okay, well anyway, I will give you an example here later on. Basta ka, lifting is ka ng a machine or an a not a machine but an equipment lang na used to lift the material going sa pinaka taas, no? Ang na eh, gear niya. Meaning na siya yung mga ka ng mga kadina, ka ng mga marsha o cloth dito. Ano na siya. So, Article 15 is about transport and earth moving. So, okay. So, another example. So, this picture was choose an actual disaster site work. Actual disaster work. So, not good, no? They are excavating while people are there. So, mag excavate gali. People should, uh, the area should be free of people. The people, uh, the the area is uh, you know, kind of kind of clear, no? Na ay clearance or na ay uh, uh, luag siya, spacious siya kay. If you are working, yun na ay mga tao di upo. Right? Kani siya na good picture ni siya, ha? So, di di kana kaning mga pictures nito ay cited from wala ako ibutang but is from Google. So, you'll be able to have this picture also available. So, yeah, ko lang sa use for picture purposes and no other reason nga pang usan. Okay, Article 17 is about plant, machinery, equipment, and hand tools. So, kani, nagkan kayo. So, sa civil, dagan yun na mga growing machine, mga cutting machine, so machine. Okay. Next is Work at heights. There. So, kinalan ka na. Kay, ano yung mga lifting? Kung ano man yung uh, uh, lifting? Uh, not lifting, but uh, sabi tawag ka na. Inaha ka ng um, safety. Ah, dili dress ka na. Something like ka ng nasa gito. Ah, na yung right term. Ay, nalimot ko. Nang imong suutun ba? Uh, proper PPE. Uh, working at times. Kaya yung kundi siyang yung kanyang kanyang i-hook ni mo i-hook ni yung gikan sa yung lawas pa rin. Kaya in case nga makabuhi ka diya sa yung mong kuwan ka niyo. So kanyang na siya PC. Na kanyang PC nakalain ni siya sa steel o kanyang na tanaw ka niyo. Nakalain ni siya diya. So in case nga mahulog siya at least kanyang siya ang mubira sa iyaha. So diya siya mahulog totally. So ngunit siya ang itawag na ito nga Work at heights, including roof work. Second, 
Uh, excavation siya, search works underground war tunnels. So, ano mga tunnels. So, mostly yung tunnels is less ang air, no? So, careful. Naga pa safety. Ano? Okay, this is an example. Pictures. Next. Work in compressed air. Yeah, compressed air. So, meaning, ipakuan ko suka yung air. So, imo siyang i- I push, no? I, I, mang, I open ang air. Uh, it produce through pressure. So, nani? Example, ani? Okay. So, ani first picture? So, ano? Yan mang gigamit, no? Gigamit din. Compressed air. Never use it to clean off your clothes, no? Murag. Murag ko, ah. Gingin mo niya. Oo ka ng vacuum. Okay. Itong vacuum. So, yup. Manta. Pero, kani? mo produce yun na siya pressure ng air so meta po na sakit siya so kanipon isa na siga na yung mata pungag ng uban ang wasli na yung frontal kusog sa car 40 psi yun ako 12 is no so careful mo ng compressed air na compressed air mo good mostly class is use siya sa pag remove sa dust but not dust si mo ang cloth si mo clothes Di dili dust sa kanang mga example kanang mag pouring of concrete laying out of asphalt concrete so mga dust particles sa ana imo na siyang clean so imo na siyang pa compress ang air imo siyang pa kon ana labay ng kon ana mga kon abog ni ba wala okay the next is structural frames and framework so this is an example how it should be implemented so here slabs columns so a proper proper way of doing the right shoring the right uh, material to clip to 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 brace no bracing no they can in my although and um, for maximum with classes Felicia Felicia uh, Dili siya limited to words only. So, formworks can be used. Ang formworks pwede itang gamit ng steel. Pwede. pwede steel. Ang plastics is not good. Kaya dili, naman siya elasticity. Taas yung elasticity. Whereas, sa kuhaan, dili, uh, although na, dili kaya siya, dili siya ma-deform ba? So, po doon, nagkuhaan ka dili yung column niya. After how many hours na, niyano na, kalit na o kuhaan, dili na column. Ngayon mo na siya kung saan man. Ngayon mo siyang panga. <laughs> Next to that. Ang iyong mong slab. Kaya sakto na di yun. Ay sakto di. Ang doon iyong slab. So, yan. Kung ano yung slab. Fix para dili siya. Okay. I think uh, 2 to 3 ata. Okay. Work over water. So, ano So, kung, ano, kung nag-work ka, niya. So, same, same location. But, so happy lang na. For example, sa bridges, or the create ka, uh, na construct mo bridges na, no? na yung mga water. Daw uh, hindi ka kawalog lang, o hindi magdala ka kagit sa salbabida, or ka ng mga life jackets. Okay, basin yung mahulog ka, or whatsoever, so kailan nag at least di ka malumos. So sa, kuwan, okay, sa mga, okay, imagine na ha, ka nang naasa, Kano mga nag-work sa bridges pa, no? Basin, ang requirement na nakabalog lang, eh. no? Sa ako na lang ang mga enjoy nga di kabalog lang, eh. May daw na lang yung mo, o oh, sa mga boyfriend, nga kabalog lang, eh. Para i-assess to. Sana, o. Oh. Sige, next ito. Demolition. So, from the word nga, demo. Ah, oh, sige, sige. From the word nga, demolish. No? Gi, 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 no? Kani, oh. So, in sa pictures, again, no? The pictures are cited to Google. Uh, ano siya available to the gun? But uh, this is only for a class purposes, no? Online class purposes. So, kani? So, maybe, I don't know. Sa story behind any, but uh, one thing is for sure is that in doing the in doing the demolition it should be nga uh, appropriate mga gamiton nga mga equipment so mga provide po ka mga precautions nga it should be clear from certain individual who are passing by or passes by 
or kanang uh, clear clear na ang area sa taas pod uh, na demolish no okay na gigiguba na ang building na pakadat to nag out nag Netflix pa ka kay wala pa na man si uh, joke jun b ito na eh basta kay Koreans na sila mm, kana so na ba careful lang ta no the safety way of doing the demolition so of course, the um, challenge na is how to, uh, man, how to dispose it properly. So, kaya naman yung mga kwanan na mga wiring, stuff like that. So, mga may lisod sa demolition. Mga mga uban, they are using demolition nga dili ina na, uh, they are using kanang pabumbahan. Uh, nga kanang kwanan, ang kwan is mo naob siya, kung lalong naob siya. Para mahog na siya dito sa pa-collapse niya ba? para usara ka collapse. Okay, next is lighting. So lighting, wala bi pali. Lighting is article 25. So kung article 25 is about lighting. Lighting, on the word na light, of course. So work at night, so kinahanglan ta usog. Simple or basic lang na siya pero So muna nga kami sa Saudi class sa una kinangan jud ang suga so meaning to say okay kinangan man make over time so okay, may na lang pang palit sa so dapat palit to right sa bukas <laughs> strong man over time so ang um, only secure good always kinabi dapat suga kay kung wala suga wagi over time kay dili masugod ang management team no wala suga na ma so man sacrifice ang safety so ang um, result dagan accident uh, dili na siya yung allow sa site. I don't know sa Philippines kayo. You no know, you know, comment na lang. Next, electricity. So, electricity is about wirings or the lines that involves the uh, the na, kanabitang electrical plants or so, how to kuan, how to uh, na, set or plan, lay out correctly or check no? the the efficiency or so mana so dili kamot gamiton or whatever ha kung wala ta kuan so kinalan ta og proper tools uh, safety precautions sa sa niya so yeah gi check i don't know na pero dapat i don't know kung need mag gloves so mostly gan need na gloves the yeah. next explosives so, explosives in the world nga Explosives. <laughs> of course, it uh, sa itong resultant explosion. So mostly, ginagamit niya siya sa nang mining. So uh, so an example, best example na class is ka nang mag mining ka, ka nang mag no oh, sa beta term na ano mag quarry ka. No, kana to mga aggregate class are some of those are di ka na siya sa mga bukid bukid. So, delete mo na pwede ng bako or jackhammer kato kay ka na mga class. Yun, napatay requirement ng mga sizes as per designs. Kailangan tayo blast. Yung lagi naman, na ay blasting. So, i-blast. Pa-blast nila. So, i-palitrik uh, pa. Tari lang ha mo. Buto mo. Kung kag sa mapulpog na siya, pwawa na siya. So, kaya sa dunamite, I, I think, delay na siya ka. Explosion niya pa na siya. 185% explosion. <laughs> Then after that, yun, ma explode. Dili, ibig sabi nga na explode. Okay na mga sizes. So, dili, kung siya ang mga sizes, yun, i-crash pag ito siya uniformly. Okay. Labi na kay uh, dolomites are used as a set, are used, are used as a set material. So, kung ito siya, dili siya po. Okay. Next. So, naalay yung mga precautions gaya po. So, layo dapat, mag-blast, and ashy plants. Then, mag-ask. I think, kanina mag-word kay Dako o isang word. So, na yung mga national laws nga bawal ang pag- So, kanina mag-word siya ka nag-blasting. Okay. Against mga ginis siya. Mga magdala-dala ka. Unless, takay por- Takay por- Purpose for having that one. So, nag-dala ka ang blasting equipment o niya naka civilian na ka. So, depende. Tingnan ang authorized vehicle, company vehicle, naka-ID, naka-roan, yeah. naka-area na concern niya, yeah. maka-add to ka nga. 
and uh, blasting area so danger keep out so kanuna kalayo so now dapat mga signages kay aron dili siya and ang people are ma warn ang layo sila para kay mambuto tag kalit ya no article 28 health hazards so, na atay gitaw ni chemical physical biological hazard toxic flammable and protective nya Search. Ani, may example. Ano yung hazard din eh. Toxic, mga gas, explosives, corrosion, mga substance. Tagahan ba? Next article, 29, ang siguro ta. Fire precautions. So, fire precautions is just simply ito ng ganap itong uh, how to respond quickly no? how to combat quickly and efficiently any fire that pwede makakos nga damage structure makakos no? po sa pagkawala sa kinabuhi article 30 is about personal protective equipment and protective coating so, number ko example ano? ako yung nara ang fire okay? so I think basic man siya na siya ng example na siya yung fire hydrant ay na ay where to go, na emergency exit para sa kanang mga boarding house or kanang mga kanang mga dagko ng mga condominiums na na sila mga fire exits sa kanan na okay even not only not only ko ano I am not talking here about buildings only I am talking also sa construction site e dili na 8 times nga basta na ka sa construction wala ka construct ka na ay ongoing nga so So, kanyang fire extinguisher are present kini siya always. Bisan gali office lang may nagkot na yung fire extinguisher and we have to learn how to use it. But, sige lang kung hiccup ano. But, wala kung may nakapatayan o ka ng fire or si ko na drain. So, kat, madlo po ko. First aid. So, article 31, first aid. So, wala kong example sa kwan. Sige lang. Sa, puti. Equipment sa tagahan man. Ilang isarch na nata ang PPE. So kung big, ako i-discuss ang PPE ha. Gamay lang. Ang PPE sa so personal protective equipment provided na siya dapat sa company. So ang bata na 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 kay safety shoes. Ang inyong saning na is kung na ay uniform, mag-uniform ka. No? Labi na kung na-exposure sa chemicals, laboratories, uh, field sites, so, sa tanan pa. So kung kuan, agit kay sa mua sa mua ang construction is We are, we are kanang, we need to wear our koan kanang cover all sugar as tang bugata. So, kanang medyo covered, cover all meaning covered in body from gikan yung tiil pa dila sa mga kamot. So, nana ka koan. Then, second da yun, nakay gloves sa tiki. So, what's that? Ang next then is nakay, kung naka sa area po din yan. Uh, Saba kayo ang gawing mga planta na construction ay machine na gitrabosyot. So, Saba kayo na ay nag-demolish. So, you have to, to wear air plugs. Then, kung kuan, of course, always may helmet. No? Ah, helmet, hard hat eh. Helmet. Hard hat, always may siya. But, make sure yung katong hard hat nga na ay quality. Okay, naman yung mga hard hat na ginuko. Sara ka paling o ano. Then, yun siya pa may goggles if necessary and I'll see what I mean wear mask don't forget to wear mask and observe social distancing okay kung karoon nga panahon na yes good appeal na good ang protocols nga observe kung social distancing for delete man siya protective gear delete siya personal ang meaning mo sa personal protective gear is or equipment is uh, a gear or an equipment that has uh, that will be using mo ang body while working so naano siya sa mga balaod na siya okay let's go to uh, article 31 kanil siya ang first aid it's all about the, the the responsibility of the employer to provide first aid no kinalan na siya trained personnel na available at anytime. Okay, in case ng emergency, nagalit dapat ambulansya, nagalit dapat ang sakinan, 
where to go what is the uh, what is the connection or what is the uh, hotline number para para ma-check na to kung sa right person nga mo check ana so sa gawa sa class kay dili kay provided man sa kwan a first aid sa company so even nga naa ka sa mong balay if it is if it is uh, related to work nga ka sa balay kung sa natulog ka uh, trabaho gila sa safety okay next is okay this is an example okay CPR again no the, the this pictures is used only for presentation sa ko ang class online there's no any no copyright no ko so cited na siya sa rightful owners okay so ani may pag bandage right bandage you know basin ulit na pukol na di na kadagan ang dugo na wa na gusto na rin siya Kanyo po siya, nasiging push, na ay insaktong pressure nga how to push, and do the mouth to resuscitation. So, spell resuscitation. <laughs> Dahil yun, build, um, mani siya, mga uh, first aid kit, no? na di mga gagmay nga box. So, ito mga gagmay nga box. Basta, lahi o oh, color. Of course, kila lai man siya sa kwan, lai lai man siya og. So man lai lai siya og kanang illnesses, lai lai siya nga mga medicines nasa box. Okay, next is Article 32 welfare. Welfare is something like how it should be, no? How it should be good to the people, no? Kani tawong uh, kaayuhan, welfare is kaayuhan sa tanan. So example kaya mga normal na kinanglan so for men is kinanglan na ICR na yung mesol limpio ilang katulgan so it's accommodation ng kananan uh, conditions for example kung init kayo sa specialist sa Saudi class init kayo so nami aircon so buhay gano'ng aircon dito in the entire year nagin mo aircon dito na naapoy ka ng tumunaw kayo nga year na mag hot ko na sa dami hot kuan ay hat na mo ang mo ang set sa aircon dili pa dili to nga cold lang there's a philippines i don't know bro ko ko nakita so kad nga ay hat there is a philippines so saudi na ah malagit siya and of course sa men and women workers should be provided with service sanitary oh, of course kung kung na ay appear sa working working community work workers group na Kaya ay meme, they should be protected or si palit pinak sila. Lalo na sa washing of mga sanitary kay na mas na mga girl, girl thing. Na nagalik tayo pala out about sa kuwan. I don't know kung anti-discrimination bill has been signed. But uh, probably, ato mga mga mods na to. Uh, LGBTQ plus communities. So, sooner, later, I don't know if mga kuwan of uh, ma uh, ma approve na siya uh, na siya ito nga to nga protection or limiting da kanang kuan ilahi sila sa mga any problem so article 33 is about information and training so of course there will be there will be what uh, There will be what class? Class can I put it? There will be there will be Thailand. Okay. Uh, there will be instructions and trainings. So for example, for first aid, so can I just like train, no, na regularly. Daily put paying na na train sila for six months. Na na. Dapat po, na na po ipag another, another months to come, itrain sa sila nga level 2, level 3, level 4, level 5, kaya yung safety officers put class na po safety officer 1, officer 2, officer 3, officer 4, officer 5. So, na yung mga levels of knowledge and trainings nga na asa matag department. So, even at, in our ranking na, na aga po na siya. And of course, while doing the, the, the training, 
no? Uh, kati mo mga na nag-gain yung mga knowledge and trainings, it should be informed, uh, it should be shared to the people na who are working sa mo ang company para po sila na apoy uh, at sila na siya ka ng nabitong understanding why you are implementing such training or such or what, why are you giving such instruction no. i-discuss mo ang mga pros ang mga cons okay uh, 34 is about reporting and accidents and diseases so siguro ano uh, uh, just try to kuha na siguro kanabitong ang anong uh, mangita ka o oh, certain uh, contact numbers no? contact numbers sa uh, person para nakai kano bitong nakai certain person nga pwede nimo i-report ang mga nahitabo nga mga aksidente o sa tunang sakit sa inyo ang area okay article 35 so it's all about implementation so i think there is a class uh, Okay, since implementation is about techniques, so kung ang management magod kay overseer magod ta. So, ang kanyang implementation skip, taas na muna siya ng procedures. So, although it was discussed here, but uh, I will not read this. Uh, I will not discuss this one. Okay. Ah, uh, um, sagali siya ng Giko. No? So, yun, implementation, kinalan lang yun nga, duties na ni siya. Pero wala man nga discuss today nga kung saan pagtahimok. Ha? Okay. Then file our provisions 39, 40, 51. So, kato lang, kato lang taman sa article uh, article 35. Inap na siguro kanyo. Each member shall. So, meaning to say, kung say mo ang duties and responsibilities as a member sa organization. No? So, unibawa ako, company ko. Ngayon na member ang ako ang isa ka united to sa DALI or sa ILO. So, kato siya. Nga to siya responsible or kami nga kampanya may responsibility towards safety. So, kung unsan may tabo sa muang uh, area or muang people, these are duties nga. Dapat din sila ma-protection. Okay. So, okay. The, I think uh, we already discussed this one. Uh, do you have questions and if you have questions also uh, you can comment sa to ang facebook page and also you can also give your insights additional informations and you can also share your 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 experiences if there is no okay that's all for today thank you for listening I just hope that uh, you understand the the way it should be when we discuss. And if you are, no, if uh, if you don't mind, I am pleased or I am happy if you want to suggest something that uh, no, suggest something towards uh, towards the techniques or the methods of teaching that I am sharing to you. So, how I am going to improve myself. So, you just try to PM me. Pari, si maula mo. Sir, pwede ba sir ka nang mag-discuss ng ita kuan, everyday na. So, di masay good pwede ko. As I promise, dili ko pwede nga mag-call every week sa inyo ha. Okay. Uh, ako na lang ihatag sa mga uh, katong uh, inyong board problems ng mga klase kay uh, mas priority na siya. Although, uh, I am, I have a uh, still subject ng yapong ko ninyo, so you have to participate lang. Uh, careful lang mo kay uh, uh, atong classes. Naga classy man ko, so I am making an effort nga the way it should be. So, since it's new normal, wala tayo mahimo, we have to adjust on and understand each other. Kay, uh, delete lang, uh, not only. The, the students are stressed no we the faculty and the, the instructors or the teachers or the your uh, your mentors are stressed also so 
we have to understand both sides okay mm, adjust no? more adjustment in order for us to understand things okay so uh, just comment if you have something to 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 add or to to suggest for my improvement so that would be all thank you for listening good day